understand it. It's like, guys, people talking about your movie is a good thing. Like, big companies. You... <laughs> if you... You do know how influential the... <laughs> It is good for people to talk about your movie! <laughs> You're not supposed to hit them with... Punish people for doing that. Like, why limit your exposure? It's insane! Like, it's... Like, oh, I can... I can completely... He's gonna get... That's gonna hurt a lot. He's gonna... <laughs> like... Seriously! Are you kidding me? But anyway, this is the kind of companies we're up... Like, we... I said, like, the consumers have to deal with. It's just like these ridiculous things, and like I, it's it's and it's a good thing that people are actually seeing this and actually saying something about it. It's just like this is stupid. It shouldn't be this way. I mean, I already have a lot of issues with like music companies as well. Like I really feel like they're a bit tight-fisted. I, I I can understand like okay, you used a, a track wholesale in your in your video. And like, okay, you, yeah, technically you're trying to distribute your music without, like, paying for it. I could see that, but at the same time, yeah, it's, it's kind of crazy how, like, how companies are so protective of music in general. But that's a whole other different, like, yeah, the music companies, yeah, they're, it's kind of a pain, too. So hopefully things will change, and I think things will change, it'll just take a while because... Companies are stubborn and they got lots of legal They have lots of lawyers to fight for them And it's gonna be a really hard fight, but it will be f but I think it has to change like it's not this is not gonna fly forever The DMCA is not your only protection Anyway, yay. Wow. She's level 44. We're actually making good pro decent progress surprisingly despite like uh, maybe I, luck is okay. It's not that useful in her case. Just keep upgrading her stats. I'm kind of focusing down on their stats now. He's kind of like the jack of all trades. Generally, that's where I want him to be. Int idol. Wow, that's actually pretty good. I'm gonna dish. Yeah, int idol I do want. Um, probably get rid of the, the normal pickaxe. It's kind of yeah, it's not very useful. I do think like yeah, like it'd be one thing if you were uploading shows. Even yeah, I always wondered like how international international broadcasting is really interesting. Like speaking of like com big company media companies, I always thought it was like even with Chinese. Um, like I, I have the most experience with internet with Chinese TV shows as well. I mean, I guess Japanese and anime and TV shows as well. And it's really interesting how the licensing is all set up. There, it's it's just odd that recently um, China has been pretty protective of not letting you watch shows on the internet that are available for the Chinese Chinese viewers in China to watch. But the rest of us are not, don't have easy access to it. Uh, what was I gonna do again? Oh yeah, I need to do the int idol really quick. Uh, yes, who am I gonna use it on? Of course, it's Kudelka. What do you think I'm gonna use it on? The more int she has, the better. She needs as much as she can, so she can destroy things. Oh, we're actually making dude progress. You did a little research about uh, the Kudelka endgame? Oh, by the way, we might actually be ready to Get another go at it. Uh, I'm gonna heal up first. I see. So that's where you went, Dex Monicus, while I was doing all this talking. Amazingly, me talking about broadcasting companies stalled enough time that I could do all this. I do like it though, it's pretty fun. I guess grinding has its uses in a stream. It allows me to have a platform where I can discuss my own p opinions about things. Because I like listening to myself talk. But in, in seriousness, hopefully you guys... Are... What to do up here to get buff? Is it information I would have been able to figure out if on my own? Or is it more of a guy dang it kind of thing? 
I am doing... I am... I think I am pretty close to being able to get another... Make make another go at the at the boss. Probably gonna get... Since I've already done... I'm actually... She is pretty close. He is pretty close. And you're... I could get you. I'm sort of doing it now a little. Yeah, I'm, I'm out... I actually can get about 3,000 to 4,000, so then I can get them there one more level. Because she's pretty close to a level, too. Am I in the right area to get the most optimal things? Anyway, I hope you guys, you, the viewers, aren't feeling this is dragging a little bit, but, you know. What can you do? Like, Tiger did warn me that things were going to get pretty rough. It's weird that, like, yeah, the final boss is so tough. Like, those bosses are really tough. I guess the peacock, the upside-down peacock fat dude should have clued you in that the game was game. You want the one-legged mummy encounters? Yeah, those are... I see. Those are the ones that are worth a lot. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't get him this time. Does it recommend I just run away and try to get for it? I, that seems a little inefficient, too, but... I for I think the yellow thing is also weak to water. Oh, I see. They drop crap loads of idols. Yes, I actually got one from a mummy earlier. The int idol. I don't know what's that's gonna die. I see, I see. Oh, guy, wait, I'm gonna check something, guys. Be right back. sing it not singing idols we'll be having another game with singing idols soon enough not soon enough but later this year i do have i think i do have a good plan for what games i'm gonna do this year for the rest of the year oh wow it, it was already pretty dead um in terms of like games i want to do i already of course valkyria is the next one i already have an idea of what the Metal Idols. Ah, a reference to an anime, of course. I actually have not seen that, but I have seen... I've maybe seen an episode of it, but... That's about it. Okay, that means Kudelka is pretty close to her level. If Edward got his level. No, oh, excuse me. Uh, no level for anybody else. But yeah, we have a game with idols later this year. Not so, not not yet. Of course, we still need to get through. We need to get through anime, anime Europe, get through Africa. I, those are get through China, and of course, and then we can talk about Japanese idols. So that that should give you a clue about which games I'm talking about. Well, someday something will come out and I'll be able to move on with my life. Resident Evil 6. Oh yeah, that wasn't... Wait, is I thought RE5 was the one in Africa. What, is RE6 in Africa as well? Oh, RE5. I've only played the demo of it. It was... The single player was kind of... Uh, heard a lot more fun if you have a, a friend with you. Oh, not the mummies, not the mummies. RE6 is China. Really? Huh. I did not know that. 
I don't know if, it, if I'll ever play a Resident Evil on uh, stream. I also feel like it's not the kind of game that... It's not the kind of game that's unpopular, unpopular enough. So it's sort of weird where it's like, uh... I'm really not, like, it's really not something that needs to be demonstrated because everyone and their mom has played it. Resident Evil is very... Resident Evil, or Biohazard, as it's known in Japan, is very, very popular, so I'm really not worried about... Not... I'm not too worried about it not getting exposure. I'd rather use this stream to show games like this one, which are... were underexposed. Or un <laughs> underrated, so, so to speak. I always have a... But like, I think it's just underexposed is more of what I like to use, because... What does overrated and underrated mean? I don't know. Like, oh, people say overrated, and it was like, according to who? There's no concrete standards by which something is overrated. Like, it's just silly, anyway. It's basically called overrated according to some arbitrary expectations by somebody. Ow, she's gonna take a few hits there. I might need to buff up his age agility. He's getting a little on the slow side now. I think she push, pushed it back. Yeah, her job is simply to just keep wailing on it. Yeah, I have a real problem with overrated and underrated. I'm just like, eh, oh well. Wait, anyway, underexposed games. It's too bad this game is not available on a PSN. It's, it's a shame too. I think this would be f like these games. There are a bunch of games that were not available. And it's just unfortunate. Right. I'm. I'm actually so Conrad. I'm actually kind of the same. Oh yeah, I need to check out your stream as well. Now that I think about it. I think I'm gonna do that for you. You need agility. You, on the other hand, are probably plenty agile. He's plenty like he's very balanced. Uh, yeah, sure. Dino Crisis, nice. I actually should check your streams out too, Conra. Like, I apologize. I haven't like. I was actually thinking about doing that at some point. Um, okay, house status. She won't be a level for a while, so I can just hold up on that. Okay, um, am I ready? We could try again. Yeah, let's give it a try. Maybe we'll do better this time, I don't know. At least he's in the 3000s. Oh, I don't care if stream for me. Okay, well, I mean like... I still want to support someone who has supported me. So, I mean, that's kind of the way I think of it. Like, I've definitely seen some of Sean Cass's stuff. He, like, Sean Cass was on this stream before. Hyper Devotion Noir. That's uh, Neptunia related, right? Dino Crisis, I've never played before. I've actually never played any of the Nept Neptunia games as well. I do have a copy of it, probably because I got it for cheap somewhere. I don't know if I will stream Neptunia, but um, there are a lot of games I could stream. That's the thing. There, I'm not gonna run out of possible games to do. But it's fun that way. But I do like to try to focus on things that are a little bit different than what I've, than what you'd see now. That well, this game's certainly different. Yeah, I heard the originals are pretty off, or actually not good, but I heard the remakes are all, they improved a lot on it. Granted, it's, it doesn't have the highest of reputations regardless, but anyway, let's go ahead and see if we can do the boss again. I already saw the cutscene, so I don't need to see it again. Maybe we'll have a chance. Maybe we can win. Uh, originals of Neptunia. The Neptunia games. 
Uh, throw Daniel's arm into the fire. Are you sure? Okay, I'm gonna skip that cutscene. Oh, yay! Star actually works to skip it. Sweet. I do not have to sit through that again. Okay, let's go up the stairs. <clears throat> let's go up the stairs. Okay, we're back here again. I'm gonna do flare. I think those things, that boss, the second boss, you need to use physicals to defeat it. You have no chance of winning without it. Yes, I was before the throwing arm thing. Right, because the th once you go to the throwing arm, you're pretty much... I think this is the point of no return. At least I don't see any way to return. Unless this is not a point of no return. After, I guess there's more mummies at this in after than before. I don't know. So what is this the point? Not the point of return? No return? Yeah, that's why I thought too. Cause like if I level and I die, I'm not gonna keep the level. So it doesn't make any sense to rush in with all it. I mean, you could use the idols from the mummies to keep buffing yourself up. So you're like you can't. Well, anyway. That's why I thought too. I'm like, there's no way you can come back. Uh, I'm gonna focus down, make sure uh, Edward can move faster. He's getting a little on the slow side. There's no defend command to lower the uh, physical attacks. That's unfortunate. E4, not a big deal. Hopefully, we'll be doing better this time. Okay, he's getting a little close. Oh, you guys get to wait as I do this. 187. Oh, that's bad. Got pushed back. Not good. These are pretty fast things, too. Oh. Oh, this is dreadful. Well, at least that's not dreadful. Their magic attacks won't do in jack squat, but... Yeah, the problem is if you level in here, you don't get the... You will not get the... Get, like, keep the levels if I die, for instance, by something. Oh, I did a decent amount, I guess. You gotta move, man. You gotta move. You gotta move. At least the game... Oh yay, she killed one of them. Nicely done, Kudelka. Very good, very good. I like what I'm seeing. Yeah, see, if, if you do, can't save, then you lose all the levels you're grinding for. As much as you, I mean, I understand, like, it is true that you would run into more mummies in here, but you couldn't keep your levels, so it's kind of like, eh, you, do, you wouldn't want to do that. So far, this is going a lot better than last time. Kudelka worked... Is, is much stronger than she was before, so she's also able to kill much more quickly. A few geysers would help. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm gonna move. I 
need to make sure they have to use a turn to reach him. Uh, actually, he's still going to get hit regardless. There's not much I can do about that. There's a save point out here? Really? Interesting. So there's a way to save in the point of no return. Hmm, that would be weird. I mean, I wouldn't be... I wouldn't put it past this game to do something like that, but... That seems kind of... Uh, nope, they're still alive. Outer wall. It could be the like the final save point, but you can't actually like go back. I guess you could technically grind in this area forever. I guess you have, but yeah, I still think you have to beat a bunch of the bosses to do it. So regardless, I have to get through the bosses to get that save. I might save there and then like, if the final boss gives me trouble, I can just save on that point and just keep grinding away if I have to. It's the last resort. Ouch. He's okay. Unfortunately, James had to take a poison, but this should go. Oh boy. Nope, he's gone. Oh shoot. Crap. I wanted the EXP. No, James, you lose the EXP. Aw, oh, come on, game. That's mean. Well, I guess Edward will catch up. Well, I could save temporarily on the outer wall. Oh, great. Well, at least she's more overpowered. She was already ridiculous. Uh, more jelly. More speed. More bit, some int, and yeah, she could. Ah, uh, James, James, James. Oh, more items. I need to throw one item away. That is fine. I will get rid of the sea knife. It's kind of, eh. We don't need it. Edward Flunkett. Can I save here? The church has become an engulfing place you can't get inside. Nope, I don't see anything. Nope, I don't think you can save. I don't think you can save, guys. I don't see any way you could do it. The guy might be wrong. I don't know if it's a Jap- is it- Well, I know the Japanese version. Oh, come on. Let me see what type of enemy it is. If it's something we can defeat, then I'm totally gonna kill it. Ah, yeah, we can beat this thing. It's totally worth killing then. I can at least get them the critical levels. I've got enough MP to last it. Wow, she's so fast that now she can attack. It's higher up. I fought. I fe feel. Oh, no, wrong one. Well, I, anyway, thank you for reading the spoilers for me. Want to move up a little bit. There you go. Hit that one, please. I might have just made a mistake, actually. Yeah, I figured it would be after the two bosses. At least they're nice enough. By the way, guys, if you, in case you were wondering, in the Japanese version, there are no save points like this. You had only to go to the regular save point, but you had no extra save points that once I save in every room. They didn't have the Japanese version. Kind of bad. That would have been really a disaster. What a disaster that would have happened. Been. Well, 
Well, James can kill it in one shot, but that's not the biggest threat, unfortunately. Well, at least the levels I make here are, can be saved. This is gonna point. Ouch! Goodness gracious, he hits so hard. I forgot to use the idols. Oops, so I'm gonna have to discard more things if he drops any idols. Crap. Crap. Just made a mistake. Okay, well, at least you can kill this thing. She's gonna kill him in one shot. After this one. Bam. Bam. Dead. <laughs> Kudelka's a real champ. I hope he drops one thing. Idols are more worth more than weapons, so... Although I'm running out of weapons to discard. Maybe I should just discard a potion or something. Potions suck. Oh, Edward got his level. Very good. He needs all the help he can get. Oh, and James got a level too. Eh. Eh, eh, eh. Take that. Thanks. Uh, well, I'm going to go ahead and use those items. What do I need? Fit. Use it. Edward. Items. Int. Who else should I use it on? James or Kudelka? Maybe Gudalka because she's gonna be primarily attacking. Luck. Oh, two. On Edward. And luck on James. There you go. That should be good. This should be. Hopefully, this will go a lot better than I think it will. 44. 70 int. Goodness gracious. Strength 55. Okay, well, what else can we do? I'm gonna have her switch weapons after she kills one of the tentacles. Okay. Okay, game. Jeez. This game's hit detections all over the place. Well. La -di -da. Let's do it. I have to figure out a way to defeat that thing. I'm gonna switch her to the bow gun after this. That's probably our best bet to deal with it. I think it can only be killed by physical attacks. Alas. Well, first, we need to get rid of this thing. Then we'll switch to guns or. Um, Pistols. Yeah, just focused it down. Wow, jeez. It can hit both. It hit both of them because they're lined up in the row. Jeez, she's really scary. Strong. Um, uh, its magic attacks are not anything to worry about. I'll probably just use the bow gun. Uh, once I killed that thing, I'm gonna use the bow gun. Okay, it's gonna move a little. That's fine. I figured that might happen. 11.55, very good. Decent. Hmm. 10.51, no, it's gonna be alive. Anyway, I suggest you move. Can he move? 
move? Nope. He's gonna get attacked, and that's very bad. 871. Okay, that's that's not the worst thing I've ever 